in mammals, the neurocranium, also known as the brain case, brain pan, or brain pan is the upper and back part of the skull. The skull can be divided into two parts, the neurocranium, which forms a protective case around the brain, and the facial skeleton, which forms the skeleton of the face. In the human skull, the neurocranium includes the calvaria, or skull cap. The lower part of the skull is the facial skeleton also known as the splanchnicranium. Structure The neurocranium is divided into two portions, the membranous part, consisting of flat bones, which surround the brain, and the cartilaginous part, or chondrocranium, which forms bones of the base of the skull. Dot. In humans, the neurocranium is usually considered to include the following eight bones, one ethmoid bone, one frontal bone, one occipital bone, two parietal bones, one sphenoid bone, two temporal bones. The ossicles are usually not included as bones of the neurocranium. There may variably also be extrasutural bones present. Below the neurocranium is a complex of openings and bones, including the foramen magnum which houses the neural spine. The auditory bullae, located in the same region, aid in hearing. The size of the neurocranium is variable among mammals. The roof may contain ridges such as the temporal crests. Development The neurocranium arises from paraxial mesoderm. There is also some contribution of ectomysynchomy. In chondrichthys and other cartilaginous vertebrates this portion of the cranium does not ossify, it is not replaced via endochondral ossification. Other animals the neurocranium is formed by the endocranium, the lower portions of the cranial vault, and the skull roof. These are not fused in fishes, and a proper neurocranium is only found in land vertebrates. Evolutionarily, the human neurocranium has expanded from comprising the back part of the mammalian skull to being also the upper part. During the evolutionary expansion of the brain, the neurocranium has overgrown grown the splanchnicranium. The upper frontmost part of the cranium also houses the evolutionarily newest part of the human brain, the frontal lobes.